Hello! Today's Paano Ba Ito Letter Sender has a question about friends. Meron siyang kailangan layuan na kaibigan. Hindi niya alam kung paano. So I decided to ask the help of someone feeling ko matutulungan niya tayo sa problem natin. The one and only, Papa P! Hi! Parang bagong gusto yung effect ha. So someone has a problem. Naisip kita na mag-advise dito kasi I'm sure in your life madaming mga toxic na tao din. And you have learned to tell kung sino yung okay isama sa buhay mo. So, shall we take a walk? Okay. Ito ang problem ni Miss How to Walk Away. Na-realize ko na he is a toxic person sa buhay ko. I cannot confront him kasi he's the type na hindi aaminin yung mali niya. I cannot walk away silently na walang explanation because I did that before and I don't think it makes things better. Paano ba ito? Malalim niyo po ba ito? I was like that before. What do you mean? It, it's, it's hard to you know tell people off or to tell a person something that would offend yes. the other person. So I had the tendency to just walk away without even confronting the situation. Mm -hmm. And in the long run, it becomes worse for the person because you, you were not a true friend. I've learned to appreciate another person's problems or what have you and then become more compassionate if i have issues i set it aside and you know kind of do that sandwich thing hmm. you know you sandwich say the good thing, thing first and then ah. you sandwich it with something okay, the sandwich thing you say a good thing first uh, and then you tell the person about your constructive yeah, thing and then good to let yeah you make that person feel that uh, you're not looking down on that person or you're not making him feel that he's inferior. You show that other person that you're more concerned, that you, you care for that person. It, it'll be easier for you to have peace while you walk away, if you have to walk away. You just have to do it eh. Kung baga, there's no other way to do it but to do it. Yeah. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll walk tayo pabalik dito ha. Okay, umikat lang kami. For you, ano yung sign na toxic na? Uh, if the person becomes a loud mouth, becomes offensive, di ba, you tell me who your friends are and I'll tell you who you are. So, parang if your friend is like that, then you realize maybe we're not on the same page. Mm -mm. If this person is it's not doing me any good, yeah. that's when you do the sandwich. True. Pwede rin naman kasi gawin na walk away for now. Parang hindi naman goodbye forever. Ang toxic kasi for me, if both of you hindi kayo nag-grow, nakainisan yeah, exactly. lang kayo. This is whether friend or yes. romantic, anyone ah. Yeah. Parang time off. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you, you let it heal first. You grow, and then if after a while you feel it's time again to reconnect, mm -hmm. pwede pa rin. Pero if you've grown apart, then I guess yun yung answer You're not mo meant to, yeah, you have to be with each other or, you know. Aww. So I guess for me, I have situations like that still happening. Pero what I tend to do now is just pray for the person. You humble yourself and forget about pride. Aww. That's it! Thank you! I don't Yeah. I can be focused. Papa Pi Parene. Eh. Oh, thank you very much. Yuck. Till next time. Bye bye. Bye. And, um, yes, last, last night, night, September 27, with Tony Gonzaga. Yeah.